This is the, the Bomberoy Flyer 2010. I'm Holly Schultz from babygizmo.com. This is the Bumberide Flyer 2010. The Flyer is Bumberide's versatile but standard stroller. For 2010, they've made a very, very minor changes. I guess if it's not broke, why fix it? Let's go through the, the minor changes first. First, they changed the adjusters on the handlebar. Instead of being on the outside, they are now ergonomically correct on the inside that you do with your thumbs. They also changed the peekaboo window into a UV mesh, and they changed the adjuster buttons on the footrest. And that's it. Otherwise, it is the same flyer that we love. Now that we've highlighted the changes for the 2010 model, let's look at the stroller as a whole. Let's start with the seat. Now this is a large and roomy seat. It is, has a 13 inch wide seat back. It's 18 inches from back of the seat all the way to the top of the seat, but it has a 26 inch measurement from seat back all the way to the top of the canopy. As you can see, our nine month tester, our three year old and our five year old fit in the stroller with no problem. As you can see, our five year old testers ahead doesn't even brush the canopy. It comes with a padded five point harness for safety. Now this is the one thing we don't like on the flyer is we don't like the one touch buckle release because it's really easy for mom to do, but it's really easy for our naughty little toddlers to do. As you can see, how long does it take a two to three year old to manage a one touch button? As you can see, our toddler is out of the, of the stroller in no time. The rest of the seat has a bumper bar. This comes standard with it. Now, they didn't change the bumper bar with the other bumper ride models. They made the bumper bar do double duty and it was the car seat adapter. That's not the case with the flyer. There's a separate car seat adapter that we're gonna show you in a little bit. There is an adjustable footrest. This is another change for 2010. The way that the footrest goes up are now little buttons on the inside to make it very, very easy to do. Now this seat has a very easy recline. It's a bar recline, which we love. It's one-handed. All you have to do, it has five positions. All you have to do is there a bar, is there a bar on the back of the stroller, pull it up, and you can put the seat in any one of the five positions, including flat, which is great for a newborn. And another feature too that moms would like to know is how upright the seat goes. As you can see, this is as upright as the seat goes, which is pretty upright, so your baby is able to touch the bumper bar if needed be, or if you use the snack pack, they're gonna be able to get in there. Let's talk canopies. The canopy on the Bump Red Flyer is fabulous. First of all, it's a large canopy, but what's great about it is it folds all the way forward to the bumper bar to keep your baby out of the element, which is nice. It has a peekaboo window, another change for 2010, is this used to be plastic, now it's a UV mesh, and it allows air to circulate through the stroller a bit, which is kind of nice. Also, there is a back storage pocket, just a little zipper pocket on the back for, you know, maybe a set of keys or something very light. Um, and another nice feature of the canopy is that it unzips. So you can unzip the canopy in the summer if you want a lot of air to circulate through the stroller and you can put the canopy in any position to block the sun but your child's still gonna stay cool that way. The fire has an adjustable handle which is great for taller parents. Now it doesn't telescope out but it does go up and down and this highest position is 42 inches from ground all the way to handlebar. So you're not gonna kick the back of the stroller with a long stride. Also what they did change with the 2010 is the way the, the handlebar adjusts. It's now on the inside, which is more ergonomically correct. Push the buttons with your thumb and that's how you're going to adjust it. And our favorite feature of the flyer and the handlebar is that it's reversible. This is unique in the world of strollers. You pull up these two handles on either side, flip the handlebar, and now your child faces you. So you don't have to bring the seat up and take it out or anything. All you have to do is um, flip the handlebar. And what's great is because you're flipping the handlebar, Bumble Ride made both sets, the front and the back wheels, lock. Because if you're in this mode, they want the back wheels to always be locked. So whatever wheels are closest to your feet are the ones you need to lock. And as easy as locking is just stepping lightly down on this button and then releasing the front ones, and that's going to give you the best maneuverability. So let's talk a little bit about maneuverability. Now, like I said, you want to always keep the back wheels, the closest to your feet, locked. But the front wheels are swivel wheels. They lock individually so that, to keep your stroller in place. And the maneuverability on the flyer is very, very good. Whether the child's facing you or the child's facing out, it's going to be a, a, truly a one-handed stroller. Now, unless you have a child that's up to the 45 weight capacity, you're going to use a little bit more wrist power. But it's very, very easy to maneuver, which we really like. The stroller has six-inch wheels and a four-wheel suspension to give your baby a very smooth ride. Now, because they're six-inch wheels, it's not very good on all-terrain. Now, I mean, get it through grass, but it's, if you are looking for all-terrain stroller, try their Indy, because that's gonna handle, you know, the, the rockier, you know, surfaces a bit better. But this is for, you know, strolling at the mall and for everyday use. 
Now the stroller doesn't have a parent tray, but it does have this handy cup holder. And this cup holder is removable. It just snaps right on and off, and it can go on either side, whichever side you'd like. Now, there is a basket underneath. Now it's a medium to large size basket. I've got my large diaper bag here. I could easily fit the diaper bag in here, but it's not gonna take a lot more than that. And what's great is with the seat completely reclined, I can still access the basket quite a bit. You can make the flyer a um, travel system with the included car seat adapter. All you have to do is take off the baby bumper bar on each side. You gotta push those buttons in. That comes right off. Take the bar, put it in the same slots, snap it in. I've also, it comes with two straps. Now I've already put these in the seat. They just snap in the seat. Take my Grego Snug Ride. It does check the website. It's a universal car seat adapter, so it takes pretty much every car seat, but just check the website just in case. Snap it in there. Take the two straps on either side, and that's going to put your car seat in there securely and turn it into a travel system. And what I like is that you can take the canopy and push it right over your car seat so to kind of give it a little bit more protection. An accessory we love that comes with the flyer. Now, it doesn't come with a baby tray or baby cup holder, but you can get the snack pack that's sold separately. And that, again, goes right where the bumper bar goes. Just remove that bumper bar, snap it in, and it's a snack pack that gives you a large area for toys or snacks and a little space for a cup, too. And what's nice is this Velcro's back out of the way so your child can have access. And when you want to close it up, it just zippers closed very easily. So this is a great accessory to add for your flyer. Now, in case you're wondering, you can fold the flyer with the snack pack attached. Now, another accessory that we absolutely love is the carry pack. Now, the carry pack's gonna go in the same slots as the bumper bar or the snack pack. So remove the snack pack or the bumper bar, whichever you're using. And here is the carry pack. Now, they changed the carry pack for 2010. It came out in 2009, but for 2010, they added a canopy and they made it so that the child is facing you. In 2009, it faced out. We like this change because we want to see our baby. Now, this carry cat's going to turn your stroller into a rolling bed for your infant or a pram. So, and plus, you can take the carry cat inside with you if you you would carry it by the sturdy handles. And what's nice is it comes with the foot muff. Then you can take this foot muff off once you're done using the carry cat and use it on the stroller in the, in cold weather. Plus, it comes with the seat liner that also you set in the seat and that's going to zip the whole foot muff on. So it's a really, really nice accessory to have. All it does is make sure you have your foot rest all the way up, your seat all the way reclined, and you're going to set the carry cut in the seat. There are two adapter pieces that you're going to snap in place on both sides. And that gives you your pram. And what I like about it is that the canopy completely covers the canopy of the carry cut to completely block your, your child from the elements or maybe from the paparazzi. Folding the flyer is very easy to do. Put back your canopy. There's two gray um, buttons on either side. Push them and pull them up and the flyer is going to fold down flat. And what I like is it has an automatic lock on the side. So that is great. And at 19 pounds, this is a very lightweight full featured stroller. All you have to do, it's very easy to pick up and you can throw it in your trunk and travel it with it with ease. So unfolding the stroller, very easy to do. All you do, oh, and it also has a standing fold. If you get the wheels in the right position, it also stands, which is a very nice feature. Now unfolding it just as easy. Just locate the automatic lock on the side, undo it, pull open your stroller, adjust your footrest, pull your canopy open, and that's pretty much easy as that. Here's two accessories that come with the flyer, a little head hugger for your infants, and a rain guard. The flyer is a great standard stroller that has full featured, but yet it's still lightweight at 19 pounds. It has this great canopy, the great adjustable handle that also flips so your baby can see you or you, the baby seats out of the world. It has this great large seat and a large basket. And this is the review of the Bumble Ride Flyer 2010 by Holly Schultz of babygizmo.com. For the most up-to-date news and reviews, check out my blog at ratedbymom.com.